Good morning, it's Chris Magnus from Street View Vagabond. I'm here with another unboxing the world video in which I uh, drop down using Street View into a place I've never been to before and explore it, see what the place has to offer. And um, uh, just again, it's unboxing. So I don't even know what I'm going to find. And uh, we check it out. Um, I'm very curious. I want to know uh, what the world's like. So um, today we're going to be looking at Phillipsburg, Kansas. Um, I start with a radio station uh, to kind of get a sense of the feel of what the community is like, what music they're listening to, what uh, events are coming up, and so on and so forth. And today we're going to KQMA 92.5 FM, um, which um, is uh, is broadcast out of Phillipsburg, Kansas. Uh, it's got a, a decent mix of some top 40 um, and some throwback stuff too. Um, you know, you see here, too, uh, too Late to Turn Back Now, by the Cornelius Brothers, which is pretty old, The Cure, Love Song, um, The Car, Steve Miller Band, um, Wild Thing, you know, um, Kid Rock, and then uh, some more kind of um, uh, stuff that's more um, uh, top 40 now, like Boyfriend out of Cap Cameron, um, In the Night Week, The Weekend, um, and so, uh, Phil. So um, yeah, so it's a it's an interesting mix, and this is not just one straight hour. This is kind of over a few days. I put this together just listening to it here and there too. Um, so it's going to be um, uh, an opportunity to kind of uh, you know listen to some new music. Today's song of the day is going to be "I Love You So" by the Walters. The reason why I picked that is because the Walters are from Chicago, and apparently Phillipsburg, Kansas used to have a uh, rail uh, a direct link to Chicago by railroad. And I'm going to I did do a really quick. Um, uh, uh, Google search a little bit and then uh, finding a little bit about Phillipsburg, but I don't have a ton of research here. So Phillipsburg is located, uh, let's go back here. Okay, so this is Kansas here. So it's up here. It's, you know, almost the um, <clears throat> middle of the state this way, but super north up here, not too far from Nebraska. Um, and uh, where we got Route 36, 183. So it's one of those towns that's kind of on the, almost on the crossroads here. Um, pretty small town, about 2,000 folks. So this is really one of those towns that's going to be perfect for Street View Vagabond um, because it's um, uh, not going to be able to see everything because we're going to put 40 minutes on the clock and we're going to check it out. And let's see what we got here. 40 minutes starts for right now. Boom. So let's grab this little dude. Uh, let's drop him right down there. I have no idea where we're going. And we're in a... Um, Residential area. I love the color of this house. Yeah, it's like a teal. Um, and this is uh, June of 2012. It's going back too far. We got a decade. We're going back in time, um, which is significant because a lot happens in a decade, especially from a, a building stuff. Well, a lot happens in a decade building wise here in DC. Uh, not everywhere is changing as fast as DC. Get it. Just double checking to see if there's any um, time. Wait a second. I just took a step forward and it just goes back to June 2008. Same teal house. It was July. Grass is greener. And this is back to 2012. There's some construction going on here. Right. Trying to put myself back on the court. Uh, yeah, so let me check this out. What's the difference? Okay, it's just 20, 2008, 2012. Okay. So they're giving us the most recent, which they usually do. I was just curious to see what we got. So we got, look at this art. What is that? I was like, what is that? It's a chair. I thought it was like a Dalmatian. Okay, cool. We got an RV. That's a pretty old school RV. Uh, or trailer, I should say, technically. Come on, man. You should know better than that. And so it's like, you know, what are we doing? Why are we doing this? <clears throat> you know, I'm just super curious and seeing like, what's out there in the world. Um, Phillipsburg, Kansas. Are we going to go to Phillipsburg, Kansas? Probably not. I've driven to Kansas a few times. I'm in this car. It's sweet. Today is Wild Wednesday, by the way. I was thinking it was Transportation Tuesday, but it's not. It's Wild Wednesday, so I'm going to be looking for something that gives me um, a nature. Look at that wheel. What's that called? Big wheel. 
well enough to know what kind of, what kind of car that is. This is still 2012, right? Yeah. Okay. There's something that's all about the details, right? All about the details. Here we go. Now we're back to 2008. Look at that. That's interesting. I think it's the cross street. That is like, wow, look at that. No signage. This is a beautiful, like, I'm going to get totally wrong, but like mid century, mid 20th century architecture. Look at those um, banisters. It's like super. That's mid century. Let's see if we got a sign up on this thing. No. There's nothing. Oh yeah, there is. Okay, I see some too. <laughs> I do. I like those banners. Those are really cool. I wonder if any kids skate on those. That'd be cool to see that. Okay, well, I'll grab it. I'll grab it. Let's see what All right, so it's an AT and T building. It's really cool. Oh, we got some folks. <laughs> um, I usually do a a good vibe, um, but they're in front of their own house. Look at that. I'm gonna avoid that. I was thinking about it the other day. It's just like this idea of like this is very invasive. There's no question about it. Somebody could use this for the visual. Yeah. Hopefully, I'm using this for good. <laughs> Look at that. Is that for sale? It is for sale. Look at that building. It's pretty sweet. So, that is for sale. That is. Uh, again, I'm still in 2012 mode. Okay, here we go. Now we're getting this commercial district area. I like this. That's cool. And it's got some interesting signage. What is this thing called? It's called the Horseshoe. Oh, it's a bar. Nice. The Horseshoe Sports Bar. Welcome riders. Welcome riders. Sturgis. Nice. Oh, okay. I thought I thought it was a um I thought it was like, you know, riders on the way to Sturgis. It's like it's a sign from Sturgis, so it's kinda like if it's a throwback sign. We can make that into um that's a horseshoe. Sign. Sturgis is the motorcycle. What would you call it? Festival? I like that horseshoe sign. That's a good angle. Oh, look at that. <laughs> nice. Oh, we got a mural too. Nice. I'm digging that. Let's go down to the horseshoe. Cool. Orange. Nice. Bar. Let's call it horseshoe bar. Yeah, or she's supposed by nice. Let's go there. We got some race cars, we got some rodeo, we got some basketball, baseball. <coughs> Let's go down there. So there's husband day. Let's check that out. Let's see what this is called. Um, 
Let me just um, welcome you into husband day. Any time to break, any time to yourself. When I go shopping, I leave your husband with us. We look after him for you. You know, only pray for his strength. Yes, <laughs> I'm not laughing hardcore because I've seen that before. Husband day. Okay, so then. All right, we'll take we'll take a closer look at this. I'm trying to get it so it's not blurry. Cool. Go into the horseshoe. There's a sign there. Okay, let's keep going. Subway. Nice truck going through town. That's cool. Oh, it's got a car on the back. Nice. Now look at that. It's like got <coughs> utility lines. I like that utility lines. Two. Okay. Maybe cell phone tower or something like that. Let's see if she is from somewhere. <coughs> I'm going to grab this shot. Grab subway. Cell phone dude. Oh, we'll see. We'll use that around. Okay, we got a theater up here. This looks interesting. The Majestic. Opening weekend. Nice. Let's get a couple shots of this. This looks nice. This up. Still in 2012. Yeah. Weekend. Let's, let's go to this corner here. Ah, oh, look at that. That's really showing 3D. Nice. Excuse me. I'm going to save this up number two. That, um, that sign looks pretty old school. I like that, that, um, what's that called? Fire escape. Just trying to get a different angle there. State Park. Nice. What's that? Golden Plains. Oh, that is a gorgeous building. I like, like no windows. That's interesting. Okay. Oriental American restaurant. Name is not the most. What would mean in name? Okay, here we go. Oh, why is this? There's some interesting stuff here. 
Golden Plains Crazy. Cool. Alright, and then I'm excited we got a lot of things here. Golden Plains Crazy. Okay. That's cool. That's an interesting building. What it's used for. Here on Fifth Street. It's fine, but it's Oh, look at that hand paint sign. It is so hot. Okay. That's, that's, well, I don't know if those are connected. That's different. Hmm. Another credit union. It's cool. Oh, that's, I was wondering what that is. It's like Pegman and I's birthday. Is it, is it, why is Pegman and I's birthday today? Is it high time to go in? Cousin? Let's see. Actually, I want to look that up real quickly. There's no Google Doodle for that. This guy. Okay. Interesting. Yeah. His birthday. Right. Cool. Okay, looks like you got a um, stadium here. I guess that's it. Actually, we can pay this. Go back here. Okay. We're still in 2012. Alright, perfect. Let's do this in Hanley territory. I got 24 minutes left. Let's do this. <coughs> Oh man, I can't get down that street. Yeah, here we go. Sweet. Oh, look at this. This is cool. Man, this is this is 2008. Home of the Fighting Panthers. That is old school. I can't believe you would do this. You wouldn't go down this street. This is like the territory. Oh, come on. Damn, it's hard to see stuff. This airport and stuff. This is like a different. Oh, God, let's go back to 2012. No, this is still 2022. Wait a second. <laughs> Where did they look? This is 2012. This is 2008. This is 2008. That track is perfect right there. That is sweet. You can have it parked in the same place for four years. I don't think I'm going to lose it. I just thought it was interesting. And why not? I'm going to take a new parking spot. Truck 2008. And then I go forward. Let's see. One, two, three, four. Ah, oh, no. It's not. He parked a little ahead. <laughs> okay. Let's 
the goalpost. Cool. Make it so it's a stable here. That'll work. That'll work. Let's see if we can bring an elevator in the background. Let's do this. Camper Stadium. Okay. All right, we're going street by street here and taking it super tactical. Let's get back into. The, oh man, we got. Uh, <laughs> she's waving. <laughs> All right, we'll grab her. We'll give, we'll give her a good vibe. We'll try that. We'll try that. This are too much. She's at our house, but let's try not to make it obvious. It's trying to get my address. There's no address. Let's do this. That's a good vibe. She's waving. That's awesome. <laughs> Vibe. Cool. How's it going? This is 2012. Yeah, I think 2012. 2012 or 2008. Cool. And this is back to 2008. Yeah. Summertime. Okay, what's this building up here? Oh, look at this. Oh man, can I get a 2012 on this one? Can I get a 2012 on this one? Yes. Those great Panthers. I think I'm going to get a better shot in this one. It's nice. I grew up in a really small town like this. It's just got a really good vibe for me, man. Um, I was just today for some reason. I was just kind of having this thought about oh the chubby pickle. <laughs> I so hope this is still a thing. <sighs> Burgers, fries, and appetizers, deli style sandwiches. Ah, oh, beautiful. Look at that. Oh, I hope you're still around. The chubby pickle. Did the chubby pickle survive? Yes. It's just like an awesome building. Look at this thing. That sign is gorgeous. It's like, it's like call port. Look at that. Am I going to be able to get a good? I'll try that. I so hope the chubby pickle is still there. Oh, no, 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 no. I want number two. <clears throat> Turn. That's down. Love. Gotta give some love. Pretty classic. Gas station. I've been to many a love across this country. Chubby pickle. It's still there. Gas station. Okay, let's do this. Let's go to the map. Love's apparently is still there. There's the loves. There's the middle school. What's this? It doesn't say. It's not. I don't know. Maybe it's not there. Maybe it's not there. Maybe it's to you. It's good. Yeah. 
of the skincare. Another. Look at that. And I see that it's closed right now. But that will be open later today. So I'm checking on. The golf course here? Yeah, it's very good golf course. There's the view. I'm looking for my funny vines. And uh, yeah, how's the view? That's funny. Come on, man. Turn my pole in. We got a golf course. That's cool. This is all residential. School services. White's food liner. Okay. Blue Street storage. And the chapel. I don't know where it is. I'm storage. Use the new Fox County Road and Bridge. Works for the buddies. Railroad. I have to go to the railroad. It's machine shop. It's a lot of cul de sac up here. Next words, first line, no, probably Dubs Liquor. Fort Bissell Museum, I'll check out Fort Bissell. Countdown. This is the elementary school. Piano studio. Is that it? Is that the extent? Might be it. Municipal airport. Cemetery. Oh, I got a windshield. This guy's oh, that's cool. Okay. As far as the uh, funny finds, do I have to use the Chevy Pickle? Well, let's see what report this is all about. Uh huh. Is this the is this the flip this one? Oh, cool. Stockade. Bad museum. All right, let's jump in and flip this one. Let's see what we got here. This is the stockade. Okay. Shot. Put this one That's kind of hard to see. We'll grab that. Cool. Okay, a couple shots here. We got 14 minutes left. I feel like I got a decent extent of the town in terms of kind of checking out map, map view. But you see, Chubby Pickle. It does not show up on the uh, does not show up on the uh, on the map. So I'm not sure. Is this still 2010? No, it's 2008. Oh, wait, this is this. I can believe it. The difference in quality of the, the lens between 2008 and 2012 is pretty astounding. Um, I'm digging this. That is. One of those merry-go-round <laughs> toys. Yeah, let's get more out. Fort Bissell. What do we think the Fort Bissell is for? It's Kansas is probably like 1800s. Probably something to deal with the subjugation of Native Americans, I guess. Protecting. The community. Picture. Taking community, but also like the flip side of that is like you know, overtaking land. Where's the old Fort Bissell? Okay. Yeah. 
of this three. We'll call this one this three. Let's, let's grab this. Yeah, some shots here. Spending some time on this. So I think we should better work with this was all about. Let's go down here to the corner and see what we got. We're still in 2012. We're still in 2012. That'll be our shot. That should do it. Cool. Let's get me out of the way. Get a big shot. Afford this way. Focus on five. All right, now let's go here. Let's look up for this and see what this is. Isn't that a, a, a vacuum cleaner too? I like it. Uh, yeah, that's cool. Was was never a military fort was built for the safety of settlers. So it's, it was not military, it's for the safety of the settlers. Okay, so it kind of goes back. Oh. What I was saying before, 1852, all roving bands of Indians were still in the area. So okay, we've got a Bissell Creek. Bissell Creek, okay. Focus was never known for our military. Protection against Indian veterans, so Indian veterans, however, they look at it. Okay. Advanced, advanced scouts, focus against stock divisions. In 1870, after the Cheyenne Indian Massacre, the Fort Academy, which four settlers were killed, the fort was torn down. It was decided that it was lacking in the trails of the Indian military. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So that's the last of your, your troubles because you were annihilated by the Americans that lived in that area, too. Um, and I'm saying this, I'm not being critical of Fort of, of, of folks where they go for the folks now. I'm just saying, you know, for American history, a lot of times the presentation of it is, you know, like we, I'm saying we, but I'm saying like, um, you know, from a narrative standpoint, it's like, oh, we need to protect ourselves from you know, Americans without seeing the fact of like, Oh, we just we were in it occupying the main force. And there's that. So, so yeah, you gotta protect yourself. Um, at the same time. Oh geez. It's not uh it's not necessarily always a defensive posture. I think that's what I'm trying to say. It's not a defensive posture, it's also like you know, this is an offensive move, even though it's portrayed as a defensive posture. Defensive move, I guess. I guess that's what I'm trying to say. It's always, an, I think it's important to be critical and thoughtful in terms of you know, how things are portrayed or in terms of how you think of history that way too. Um, I love that photo of all those bikes there at the pool. So I grabbed that. That's cool. Okay. And now we're into residential areas. So let's go back to the map here. So that was the fourth. Stevens. We did the Majestic Theater. Yeah, we didn't go up this way. Let's jump down here. This is this is the huge. Uh, this is the crossroads, right? We were up there. Oh, look at that! What's that guy doing? What does that say? Show Hands Cafe. It's a gorgeous sign. Shelly Ann's Cafe. Let's not cut that off too much. We got Karsten in the other house. Let's play with Shelly Ann. Yeah, so that didn't show up. Which is another thing where it's like, you know, not everything is. Not everything's on street view, not everything's, yeah. Uh, you gotta get that, you gotta check it out. 
Street Tashi, blah, 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 I did do, read, I did do a really quick search on Phillipsburg and they have a riverless festival, which I think is brilliant. There's no river, and usually a lot of towns have a river festival. Phillipsburg does not have a river. Um, here's the dead zone. Yeah, so they have a river list. Cool. Dead zone. Right. I feel pretty good. I got like. Zone Phillips. Middle yeah. school. No, there's no website. This possibility just does not exist anymore. This was over a decade ago, or no, it was flatly a decade ago. So I think. Let's get this home store. Good. Hardware store. Looking good. Home store. Uh, a lot of cars parked here. What's going on? Look at this. We got a, we got a <clears throat> cobblestone street here. That's cool. Let me get this. We'll capture cobblestone street with the hardware barn. <laughs> barn. It's not a barn. Like the warehouse. Okay. Stone. It's not cobblestone, it's brick. I know it's not cobblestone, but first national bank and trust. A lot of banks, credit unions. They are, look at that. They are set up for drive through. Like, can you? Oh, wait a minute, it's a drive-in. That is cool. I mean, I, you know, most banks have a... Most banks have a... an option for drive-in. But I think this is like legit. Like, you have to drive through. Right? That's what it looks like to me. Legit drive in. Drive in bank two. What do we got here? Like, I'm intrigued. Because it looks like you can't actually enter the building. I mean, I guess you could. There's a parking lot, right? And there's a door. But I'm just saying, with a town this size, with three drive in bays, although there's nothing, there's nothing there. <laughs> there's only one drive in bay. Look at that. Interesting. Okay, never mind. I thought it had three drive in bays. I mean, it does have three drive in bays, but. Oh, excuse me. This street, I'm intrigued. Why this street? This is like really nice. 
Is that a, is that a lot of uh, a lot of uh, brick, right? Look at that. Second Street gets the brick. Second Street gets the brick um, treatment. That is a lot of things too. Okay, let's go back to town. Right. So that was Second Street, oh, which is this. I don't think I got like a good church shot. Let's go with the church. There we go. Let's put you more of a steeple. Oh my gosh, that's awesome. Look at that. And there is a chair. And the curb. Nice. We got one minute left. Let's grab the chair. All right, guys. Chair. We got a green elevator. <laughs> they got dogs there too. <laughs> nice. I see a green elevator over here. Let's go up to the green elevator. Got 52 seconds. Okay. Let's see this. Does that have like antlers? I think they got a lot of antlers. Oh my gosh. Okay. Oh, here's another brick street. Interesting. All right. What else to do? Ah, oh, we're back to 2008. Is this all 2008? Or is it back to 2012? Okay, 2012. Let's grab this. Yikes. A little too close. It's a nice one there. Oh, perfect timing. Time's up. Time is up. And we will stop right there at the Grand Elevator. Go with the railroad tracks, which I started with. Stop and buy. It's a connection to Chicago with the railroad. <clears throat> and uh, the reason why we have song of the day today is a band from Chicago. So, anyway, this was Phillipsburg, Kansas in 40 minutes. I know there's a lot more we could do here. This would be a good candidate for grabbing an interview with somebody, maybe doing it at the Chevy table. Could be fun. And uh, checking it out. So we're going to call it a day. And uh, say, uh, if you watch it to this uh, long, I'm sure you uh, didn't mean to. <laughs> so I'm sure you pressed play, walked away, and uh, uh, <laughs> just so happened to go all the way through. But Anyway, this is always fun today. It looks like it's Pegman's birthday. So let's give it up for Pegman. And, uh, oops, bird. School bus. We're done. All right, thanks.